Before this video starts, guys, I am giving away $250 PayPal. Look at the link in the top of the description if you guys want to join. Also, I am live streaming right now on Twitch. Well, as I'm recording this video. So if you guys want to follow my Twitch, that's one of the steps as well. So make sure to follow all of the steps. Good luck to everyone and have a great Christmas. Let's just straight into this video. What's going on guys? I'm Incom Zubits here and today we are back with another video on Chaos Craft. If you guys want to join and play with me, make sure to join using my IP, imake.chaoscraft.org. Also, if you guys don't have a rank on here and you want a free rank, you can still use my code IMAKE for a free champion rank on the store. The link is in the description down below. So in today's video, what we are going to do to start it off is if I do slash keys, I have 20 Omega crates, or no, I don't have 20. I have 15 Omega crates or crate keys. And that is the best crate on the server. So if I go ahead and go to warp crates, we're gonna open all of these in today's video. Uh, there is so much stuff you can get out of it. I, the main thing that I would want is the five to eight iron golem spawners. And then obviously I think mob coin pouch would be good, the tier three, um, the boost. The boosters would be good. Um, November crate would be good, but uh, we definitely need the iron golem spawners. I have had those set up for a while now. We've made over $6 million just off of the iron golem spawners I have in there at the moment. So if we get some more, that's definitely gonna help us out. All right, so let's go ahead and start opening the Omega crates. This might take a little bit, but it's gonna be worth it. I, I hope we get at least the iron golem spawner twice. Four X ultimate keys. I mean, I'll take it. So if we get four extra ones, you know, we can get iron golem spawners out of that. They're not the best crate though. All right, we have 14 left. Let's try and get something else. The next one, we got three to five iron golem spawners. So we're starting to get them and we got the most. We got five of them. Next one, we ended up getting five X epic keys. So we've already opened three Omega crates. We've got keys, we got spawners and we got keys. So it's working great so far. I am, I'm really happy with this. 3X mob coin boost. So off of the fifth one, I got a tag. I, I didn't know what it was exactly. I had to look it up. And I got five to eight iron dollar spawners off the next one. We have 10 total already. Dude, I, I'll take it, bro. Keys or iron dollar spawners. That is what I want. And that is what we are getting right now. One more over. Oh, we were so close to five to eight again. We got another awesomeness tag. That's exactly what I got earlier. I, I don't want it. Bro, just give me the five to eight iron golem spawners and I will be happy. Or, I mean, honestly, any other spawner as well. Why do I keep getting the tag? Why do I keep getting the tag? That's the third time. I don't need a random awesome tag three times in a row. I got the beast one, whatever that, whatever that is. We got close to a zombie spawner. We're gonna get the pro void chest off of that. We have six Omega crates left. Oh, well, not after this one. We got five after this one. Hopefully we can get something good. We got two to three. Mushroom spawners drops one to three X emeralds. Uh, that's definitely interesting. I don't think I've ever had a mushroom spawner on Chaos Craft. I know I didn't the last time I played and I know I don't this time. So I, I don't think I have 24 hour fly permission, rare reward. I might end up giving that away because I'm, I'm pretty sure I have permanent fly uh, or I might sell it on the auction house. We got four more crates. If we could get some more crate keys, that would be good as well as like we were getting before. Uh, we got another mob coin booster though. I don't know what the best items is like I was trying to say at the start. I was trying to look and see what the best would be. Uh, but the main thing that I want is the iron golem spawner. So we, I think this is our not, next to the last one. We got some more. Five to eight. Five to eight. Come on. We got six that time. Okay. I think this should be our last crate. And if that is our last crate, we have got 16 iron golem spawners so far, and I'm definitely happy with that. And we got another random tag, of course. 16 iron golem spawners, two mushroom spawners, a fly voucher for 24 hours, three X mob coin booster, two of those, two pro void chest, and I got some awesome tags, whatever that is. We also got some keys, so let's go ahead and do slash keys. We have five epic keys, we have zero omega, and we have 14 ultimate crate keys. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back to my island now and add all of these iron golem spawners into our mob grinder. You guys don't remember I made this last episode. We only have six right now. And I made six million so far off of them. So adding 16, we should get a lot more money. The only issue is I don't have anyone AFKing at the moment. So 
it's probably not gonna spawn that much or uh, overnight or anything. I might have to AFK an alt here and see how much money we make overnight one time. Uh, the sugarcane farm, not gonna mess with that this episode. I think I'm gonna like, by episode three, which this is episode two, I think the next time we're gonna be building this up uh, as high as possible or at least five more layers. I don't know. I want to make a huge sugarcane farm for one of my videos. I have that planned. We got the pig spawner over here. Uh, what do we have in here still? We still have the creeper spawner. We have the zombie pigman, zombie spawner. I don't know how to make them. I really don't. I don't know how to make creeper spawners on here. I'm assuming they don't explode on your island, but I, I've never learned how to make a creeper spawner. Uh, zombie pigman, zombie. I could probably make one of those, but I make grinder ones. So I'd have to, I'd have to grind it out. I mean, I do have a grind sword. So to make a mob spawner, I'm gonna need a lot more uh, zombie spawners. I think that's the main thing that I'm gonna have to go for. Uh, it's only 0.6 mob coins each, but if I get a bunch of them, I have six mil, I could buy, what is that? That's 12, 12 zombie spawners. And then I already have uh, one. So we'd have 13 zombie spawners, which is not a lot. Someone was saying creeper spawners are really good, but to see what the creeper spawners give you is I'm gonna have to upgrade to tier three or tier four. I don't, I don't wanna click the wrong thing. So if I right click, okay, there we go. Creeper spawners are two mil each. They give you one mob coin per creeper. So five creeper spawners is not gonna do it. Uh, tier four spawn, I unlocked it. You've gotta be kidding me. So you can't see how much they give you without unlocking. So. We just wasted 10,000 mob coins. I'm totally oblivious to that. So to see, I guess iron golem spawners would be in tier four. So how many mob coins do you get from iron golems? I'm literally gonna have to set in here and kill them, I think. Because I have lava killing them right now. So I'm not getting any mob coins. So wait, if I kill one, how many mob coins do I get? It should pop, I get 12. How many did I kill though? That's the question. I just killed one. You get 12 per iron golem? Yo, we might have to turn this iron golem spawner into a, a mob grinder because if I'm getting 16 per, I need a better sword though. Do I actually have to just sit here and grind it out? I feel like that would take a very long time to get how many I need. I do need 30,000 mob coins for the mob generator and I think 35,000 for the good mob generator. So, I mean, it would take a while, but the iron golems don't go anywhere. We got 46 right here, 45. I don't know. I think I want to do one that would actually one hit the mob instead of me having to hit them like uh, five times. Pigs may be the way to go, actually. Uh, I can buy a pig spawner for pretty cheap. Uh, what was that, actually? Let's do slash shop. Is there pig spawners here? Uh, tier one spawners. Pig spawners are 100k each. And then I think they're, I don't know how many mob coins, 700 mob coins. So I'm not spending mob coins for them, but 100k each for a pig spawner and me just spam clicking the pig. I'm getting 63 per and 50, 90 per, 96 per. I do have a bonus on obviously, but getting a hundred in about five to 10 seconds, that might be the move to be able to get a lot of mob coins. I mean, since we have $6 million, I don't think this is going to hurt. Uh, we are going to buy, did I just do my math? It's extremely wrong. 100K each, 20 should be two mil, right? So we have 37 pig spawners now. And that should spawn a lot of pigs and that should get me a lot of mob coins. Now, something I did realize is I had a three X booster on. So really I should have not been getting 90 per. I have a two X booster on right now. So I'm getting like 40. Every time it updates, uh, you can see it above my health bar, above my XP bar. So I think realistically, if I was killing these pigs without a booster, it would only be giving me 16 to 20 mob coins every five to 10 seconds. So, I mean, that's still very, very good, but I like having the three X booster on. I need to show you guys also how much we ended up making from the mob spawner or the iron island spawner, 2.5 mil. Uh, so that's really good considering I didn't spend any money on this. Uh, obviously all the crate keys we ended up getting the mob spawners with, uh, and then I spent some on the hoppers. I think it was around 60,000 if, if I'm correct, uh, four hoppers, but I ended up not using them because we got a chunk hopper. So I wasted money there, but we've made a $2.4 million profit and, uh, it's still going. So that's very, very good. So literally what I've been doing is just killing the pigs. Every time they spawn, they spawn 40 at a time. So 
one pig or one spawner is one pig. So if I ended up getting more spawners, uh, I think it would definitely help. We have almost got back to 10,000 plus mob coins. There was 200 pigs down and I went ahead and used another 3X mob booster and I'm getting mob coins very quickly now. We have 100 pigs that I need to kill. We are at 9.7 thousand, you can see on the right side of my screen. So off of these, I might be able to hit 10,000 mob coins. And it was going really slow until I did the 3X boosters. The 3X booster definitely helps. We need to try and get some more of those if I do want to upgrade or, or get more mob coins. Ended up getting close to 10,000. We are so, so close. Actually, whoa, it updated. We actually hit it. Barely had enough to get 10,000 off of those mobs. Um, pig spawners. I'm not sure if that's the way to go, to be fair. Because you need a 3X mob booster to um, even get uh, up to like 50 mob coins a time. So pork is 0.50 mob coins each. Uh, tier 2 spawn. I don't know, man. Because they're easy to get. But it does take a lot to be able to get a good amount. So I'm not sure. I'm really conflicted. Maybe someone who plays Skyblock can comment down below. Say what the best grinder is. I'm assuming you're going to say Creeper or Iron Golem or something like that, but I feel like the best way to get mob coins if you have a boost, it's just the lower spawners because you have more. So now, if you guys remember at the start of the episode, we ended up getting some extra crate keys that I can open. So we have four ultimate crates that I'm going to open uh, that we got from the Omegas, and then we have five epic crates as well. So hopefully we can get some more Iron Golems off of this. That's really the main thing I'm looking for, and we just got four more epic crate keys from the ultimate. What are my, what is my luck? Literally, I have a bunch of crate keys and we're getting more crate keys off of the crate keys. Like it's an, it's just, it's crazy. We just had two to three more creeper spawners. So if creeper spawners are the best, like someone said on Skyblock, I asked in the chat, someone said creeper spawners are the best. If they're right, we're, we're building them up. I think we have seven now. I'm just not sure if that's correct. We got two to three iron golem spawners so we can put more in our iron, iron golem spawner. So that's definitely gonna help us get a higher balance and uh, I like the iron golem spawners. I like getting them. Two X tier three money pouch. We got two tier three money pouches. Uh, this should be the last ultimate crate that we have. And then we can open some of the epic crates. What are we gonna get? We got a three X mob coin boost for five minutes instead of 10 this time. We're opening four epic crates now. Hopefully we can get something good. And the first thing we got was two to three blaze spawners. Uh, I don't plan on making a blaze spawner at all. Probably will end up selling those or maybe just placing them on my island to get island top value. Uh, but we have three more. Iron Golem spawner, no. Tier three XP pouch. Um, and really, I don't know what XP is used for. Um, I might seem stupid for not knowing that, but that's one of the main things I don't know. It gives you XP on Skyblock. Uh, I'm not sure what XP is used for on Skyblock specifically. I do know what XP is used for on Minecraft. So let's see the next thing. We're getting another awesomeness tag or awesome tag, you know, <laughs> love it. Uh, and then on the final one, give me some iron golem spawners. And we were, we were so close to getting a witch spawner. Unfortunately, we got another XP pouch. So we're going to go ahead and go place down the iron golem spawners that I did get. And that is going to be it for this episode. But I do want to see how many I have. I think I had 22 iron golem spawners. Is that right? So we should end up having, my math is correct, 29. And that is a lot more than what we started this episode with. So we're probably going to have some more money. We're ending the episode off at 4.6 mil. Let's see what we have in the next episode. We have 40 pig spawners as well. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.